Hi, my name's Penn Ward. Kent Osborne. Rebecca Sugar. Adam Muto. Jesse Moynihan. And Tom Herpick. And Adam's here now, so he can tell us what vacillate means. Yeah, it just means to sort of go back and forth on an opinion about an issue, like dither, you know? Right. Yeah, dither. You're a flip-flopper. <laughs> Adam, whenever I need to know anything about anything, Adam's work extension is four one two three. And I remember that because it was the easiest work extension to remember. And I would dial it and be like, "What does vacillate mean?" And he'd be like, "Well, it means exactly this." Yeah. Because he, it's in. He already knows. It's faster than the internet. But when I'm wrong, though, it's, it really sucks. Yeah. Right, I'm like, yeah. Oh, shoot. Is that really what I think it means? Or. Oh, anyway, we should probably talk about the episode. Yeah. Did that really take up six commentaries just talking about the word vacillate? No, it's just been, a, you know, like, I'm not sure if I was using it right, but I was. So uh, <laughs> that's good. Uh, this episode is uh, Jesse and Akko and uh, boarding. And uh, we had the bucking uh, wild animal, which is a scary thing <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> Uh, so this is a sort of like a horror episode. Tried, and Akko and I tried to make it as creepy and off, whatever, off-putting, off-putting as possible. <laughs> and I like the idea of an abandoned town and, um, and a person waking up. Uh, it's sort of an homage to a, a famous sci-fi. <clears throat> Something or other, <laughs> right? <laughs> Where a similar scenario happens, but you know, we're doing our own take on it. <laughs> <clears throat> Clap your hands if you know what I'm <laughs> talking about. Man, you're awake. Yeah, I'm awake, but my jams are all busted. Crazy Jake. <clears throat> it's not a very flattering so portrait of Jake in this oh, yeah, other episode. I so. Maybe. We got hit in the head. In the first sequence. Yeah, it's sort of like a what if scenario if you know, if, if Jake loses his mind, what what would that be like? <laughs> I don't know. And also if Jake loses his mind and also is like uh, harboring some deep fear about some something he doesn't you know, he's like repressing a, a fear of something awful that could happen. I and mean, it's like a combination of those two things. That's that's what I was thinking about when I was trying to write his, his dialogue anyway. Only come out if they think we'll be surprised. So we gotta act like we're totally unaware, okay? Now was he really how do we do this keeps coming up. Was he really unconscious for six months? Or is that left to our imagination? Yeah. I think it was uh, like a dog years thing. Oh, okay. So his his concept of time is Come on, let's go back to the hut. Different or something? Uh, because it, it doesn't make sense. <laughs> yeah, I buy that. <laughs> uh, that Finn would have been in a, a body cast for six months and still have hurt le injured legs. I don't know. It didn't take His legs would have healed up by then. Yeah. <clears throat> well, aren't they healed, but they're just in that cast? Because he busts out of them? Uh, yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, but also they would have atrophied and you wouldn't be able to walk on them, I think, and yeah, use yeah. them for six months. Well, he'd be months. dead without food. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You fly like IV or something. Oh, sure a lot of questions. Here. But he's uh -huh. full of awesome will willpower always, right? Yeah. Me. Even if they're crumbly, atrophied oh, legs. Like, How long was I out? Uh, that, power that, that little boy energy. Huh. What a oh. place to be. I don't know. Sure seems like a good time Glamour to come shot. out if y'all are just hiding and you don't, you know, want to yeah. see me pop myself. <laughs> <laughs> this is Jesse's section. I think he was stoked. <laughs> I was. I was stoked. I don't know why, though. I'm not sure. <laughs> don't think about it too hard. All right. <clears throat> what happens to Finn's neck when he puts his hat on? Like, it inflates like, like a bluefish. Cartoon magic. <laughs> is it just falling yeah, to his shoulders? Right. That's right. There's there's empty space in there. Yeah, there's yeah. empty space. If you press or it's it, hair, man. It's all it's filled up with hair. Yeah, that's it's a good, too. it's a good hat. Don't talk so loud. It's very stiff. I hear you. It's never been washed. What if you're in trouble? What if something? I think season three is when I started trying to do um, eye eye reflections and stuff because uh, I saw other people doing it. <laughs> and I was like, I never tried that. <laughs> you mean the highlights? Highlights, yeah, eye highlights. 
Do you still do an hour, or did you grow uh, out of it? I, no, I still do it. When it's uh, appropriate, I guess. Hey, it's you! Pen called Thanks those breaking shine my ball legs, you eyes. Butt. Shine ball eyes, yeah. A little misdirection there, I think. I was trying to do. For the deer showing up. And that sounds like candy people. Jake, Jake. Perspective. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. right. oh, thanks. I heard a sound coming from the sewer. We should check was it hard that his legs oh, man, couldn't bend to move him around? Yeah, it was hard. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. it's making me frustrated just watching it. <laughs> I drew that paint, that Six little months. drawing in the far Six left. Months. Painting of what? Uh, it was a Finn and Jake, but it was like my original doodle that I put in there at the at the end. Do you often do that? It was to replace something that looked too wonky. There was something in it that was like, mm, gotta change it. Face it, Finn. I think you might have added those extra cockroaches too. On that. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Yeah. Extra. Yeah. Those are cool, man. Oh, and uh, the, those Jake eyeballs there, I, I copied from you from uh, Rainy Day Daydream. Those were a mistake. I know, <laughs> but I thought it looked good. So I was like, oh, I'll use that sometime, like the it was, triangle eyeballs. Yeah, there was there were too many of them. We had to, re we had to revise it. I, I think, think it was cool. I just did it because it was faster than doing... <laughs> Actually, that doesn't make sense. No, they were like thumbs, like you did yeah. super fast, and they just got uh, produced. That's right. Wrong. Lost in translation. Hey Jake. Dude, you, you gotta you kiss that microphone, Adam. Okay. Can you not hear me? Yeah. You gotta get off on Jesse. You gotta chain. You gotta switch up. You gotta. We're, we're sharing mics. You gotta get cozy. Lady, did you get extra Everybody. For all the potty people? Um, I remember. I have like a vague memory of Akko going crazy doing this uh, her section of this board. Uh, in a similar way to Jake going crazy <laughs> in this episode. It felt very uh, synchron synchronous. Synchronous? That's a word. Yeah, like Akko's mental condition was reflecting <laughs> Jake's mental condition. Uh, I was a little worried <laughs> about for Akko. <laughs> that Finn walks really funny in the cast. Like swerving his whole body. Yeah. yeah. Taco's happy now. Yeah. <laughs> All better now. Don't go. Um, she did some great conceptual drawings for this part where Finn comes out of the water here. He's like uh, pencil drawings. Uh, maybe someday they'll show up in a Art of Adventure Time book or hey. something. Uh, that would be cool. I remember too when he uh, dove in, Jake mm -hmm. grabbed him by the cast, and then the cast breaks and he falls. Oh. It's like maybe like a cut time or something. Or... Oh, I thought it was, that was nice. Thanks. <laughs> I mean, Akko says thanks. <laughs> <clears throat> this part's kind of scary. Yeah, it's uh, like a good <laughs> nightmare fuel. Surprise! Surprise! You? You did this? I did this? It's so intense when that brick hits the deer. It feels really bad. Uh, but the deer actually uh, survives um, this episode. Yeah. Uh, but then doesn't survive in a later episode. <laughs> Which episode? Sons of Mars. Uh, Sons uh, of Mars. Oh, yeah. Baby, I told you never to call me here. <laughs> but maybe you could still turn back i mean you could turn you know you got turned into a telescope or maybe you could you lost your mind, man. someone well, could change him back if they ever found that there. telescope Look. what no it's not even close to my b-day i'm so sorry oh you got a tiny you, you, thin. You <laughs> <laughs> what then who did it was him <gasps> oh, that's a very gifable moment. Kids like the deer. Just want to see him get hit with that thing. <laughs> Jake, you free the candy people. 
I'll take on the deer. No! What do you think those helicopters are doing above my house? Searching for crime? Yeah, they're searching. One time I called 911 because uh, a helicopter was flying around my house for like an hour and it was rattling my house and I was trying to draw. I got so mad. I called 911. I was like, hey. Crunch. <laughs> Crunch. I told them to cut it out. <laughs> Are you kidding? No. I'm not kidding. It was making me insane. Were they like... Felt like I was living in a... Sir, please don't call. I was like, why is there police? What are they doing? <laughs> why have they been flying over my Sir, house? Sir, you know this uh, hotline is for emergencies only. <laughs> yeah. You can get arrested like, for that. They were like, uh, they're looking for a car thief. And uh, I was like, all right, could you tell them to cut it out? It's making me crazy. Tell them to give up. <clears throat> it's, it was like my the walls were shaking for an hour. And flying really well. Yeah, I'm angry about it. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> For one of these, we should just tell, you should tell a ghost, one of your ghost stories. Okay. Just for the whole... Whole commentary. Episode. Yeah. All right. Well, next one. That's one of mine. Do I have another one? Well, let's find out. All right. 